I'm so pleased if a patient will come to me to talk about intimate subjects such as sex or they're worried about their body image, whether it's after radiation or after mastectomy. The first thing is we must be doing something right because we've developed a good enough relationship and there's trust that you can come to me and talk to me about that because that's so important. And some patients are so focused on the cancer that they forget what's important to themselves as a whole. I have had lots of young women have surgery, have treatment for cancer, go on and get married. So they find the right partner. And the right partner in my mind is someone who's really able to see the beautiful person that you are, no matter what surgery that you've had. With respect to patients who are concerned that their current partner may not be as pleased with how their body looks, well, that's a conversation to have with their partner. That's a conversation to have individually, how do I feel about myself? Because it's complicated. They may be projecting their feelings onto what they think their partner may be feeling, but really, it's insecurity that they have about themselves. And it takes time after breast cancer surgery for some women to feel sexy again, to feel good in their skin again. They may no longer have sensation in their nipples. They may no longer have nipples. They may have decided not to reconstruct their breasts. So how do they feel sexy? How do they feel sexual? What other parts of their body might they tap into, look into, to feel good about themselves or to use when they're intimate with their partner to not necessarily replace what they, didn't, what they don't have anymore, perhaps make them feel still sexy and in the moment. 